You know my situation Could fuck with me and stack all these blue faces On the real, these other bitches is basic To keep it really where I'm trying to get you naked I know I got a bad reputation They just wanna see you lose when you make it Everybody on my line, they can save it Yo, what it do, it's your boy MTZ King And I'm back on your screen I hope everybody has a great, amazing Tuesday Um, I'm just right here chilling uh, I'm starting this vlog pretty late because it's already like 2 o'clock But it's kind of been busy, I was cutting my hair Then I put the last paint in my head Then, you know, I was just chilling right here, whatever uh, talking to my mom about my little brother. They were chilling in here with me for a little bit, but now they went downstairs. My little brother's been doing his homework, though. And we're just right here, just chilling and stuff. My pop's about to be coming home. Uh, and yeah, you know, uh, decided to wear the muscle shirt because it's freaking hot in the mud today with my black shorts and my J's that I wore. Like, I actually bought this for myself, I believe, like two years ago on my birthday. So I'm wearing these. Uh, I put the champions to the side for now because I have been wearing my champions and stuff, you know. Uh, but I am, I am a Jordan fan. I'll always be a Jordan fan, no matter what. Uh, shit. Um, I also have Nikes and stuff, so you know, it just depends what kind of mood I am, I am in, and what I'm wearing. Because of course, obviously, I gotta match, you know. From my head to my toes, you know, like shit. You really check this out right now. Look, I'm, I'm even matching my boxes. I got my Kelly Klein on. You know what I'm saying? They're gray and blue. Shit, they got a match. You know what I'm saying? That's just been me, guys. I don't know. I feel really weird when I don't match. It's and it's really rare whenever I don't match because you always catch me matching. But whenever, even like if it's just to sleep, I feel weird and I'm like, oh heck no, I gotta put this on because I just don't feel right. Like it just, it don't feel right. You know. Um uh so yeah just right here though um just doing that and shit i had to do all my skincare on my face today because man yeah that medicine that they gave me they gave me this medicine they had prescribed me this medication my dermatologist did and it was for the face for it um because you know i have really uh, I was breaking out and that was weird because I hadn't broke out in a while and at one point I started breaking out a lot and I'm like what the heck is going on so they gave me this um this medication and then I actually I got is this medication right here they gave me this and then I got this other thing online and uh I've been putting those on like I'll put that one on in the morning then the other one I put on in the afternoon and then at night time, I'll put it on again before I go to bed. So it freaking actually helps. What it does, it brings out all your blackheads and like all like the dirt or whatever. And uh, then too, I also been, well, yeah, I've been using this too. The Nevo, no, this, that mask thing, whatever. I've been using this when I shower. Leave it on for like five minutes and that shit works. So... Because I am really, really, uh, like, I, I care a lot about my skin and my face. So, that's why I'm just like, man, I got to start doing my thing again. Uh, and because, like, my, my, my skin is really dried and stuff. So, instead of me using, like, lotions, the doctor said it's not good for me to use lotions. For me to use, like, you know, um, like, for instance, like, baby oil or, or like, Vaseline. Because, apparently, that breaks down the... Like, for me, looking so damn ashy and stuff. So, that's how I've been, you know, taking care of all that, too. And I did work out today, actually, before I started cutting my hair and doing all that. I was hitting my push-ups. I did my sit-ups. Uh, just doing regular, you know, stuff. Uh, it's kind of hard for me to hit push-ups, though, with my hand being messed up. And I only had this brace on because, like, to try to help it, like, to move it. But I have been taking it off. But when I, it starts hurting again, I'll put it on. And it's just to help from, like, to try to get it to position, basically. Like, to help it to get back into position. Because uh, yesterday, I actually had to pop it 
I popped it out and had to pop it back in. It was crazy. My dad actually helped me, but my dad was like, my dad was t told me to pull because he didn't want to pull it, like to hurt it more. So I actually just pulled when I pulled it, it popped, but um, I popped it back in, but it still, it had been hurting me. So I just had to brace on for now. I literally just actually put it on right now though, because I had it off while I was cutting my hair and doing all that to not get hair on me. Oh. Well, other than that, though, I'm just chilling, so I hope y'all chilling, too, doing what y'all got to do, um, getting through life and these difficult times right now that we're going through, uh, but anyways, I'm going to go ahead, and I'm going to catch y'all in a bit, and y'all stay safe, though. Chill. there across the street guys uh i don't know like if somebody's stuck inside a car or something but they just literally turn on that bright the bright light the fire department uh i was just chilling in my bed and i just heard i don't want to go outside because you know if it's anything that's on fire it's bad for my health to uh, inhale it to breathe it in so that's why i'm just looking from the window but I was like, damn, I'm like, that's some good ass light, light, lighting. <laughs> I was like, I need, I need whatever light the fucking fire department have. So it'd be cool for when I a vlog. <laughs> damn, check that out though. There's a full moon. That's the moon right there. Uh, but yeah, I was like, what? But anyways, let me uh, hit y'all back up in a bit. Cause I got a, I think I got a message. So let me hit y'all back up in a little bit though. Shit. Yo, what's up with a good squad? I'm back. Um, just right here chilling in my room. You know what I'm saying? That's all I could do is just chill. You know what I'm saying? I'm in a little tight ass corner, real talk. Cause I'm trying to get some likes. I don't want to turn the big light on. <laughs> my little brother's in here, but he's about to get ready to go to bed in a little bit. Cause then he has to get up for school in the morning. So. Cause they do their thing online or something like that. Uh, that's the new, that's the new cool way. Nah, that's just the way that they're doing it right now. Since all this stuff is going on, I'm sure ain't nobody in school. If you are, that's a shocker. Cause from what I've been hearing, there's a lot of people are not in school. Uh, but yeah, I'm just right here chilling. Man, I need to get a new uh, nose piercing. So I'm actually able to change it out already. Cause it's about to be two months. On the 20th. But being broke. Ain't got no money. I can't get one yet. Hey. I think I'm going to be working on a new song. It's for a special. Special somebody. It's probably going to have a special somebody's name in it. Maybe. I don't know. This person though is somebody. You know. Phew, Somebody actually is a TikToker and a YouTuber, so yeah, you know what I'm saying. Um, but yeah, you know, that's all I'm doing right now, just chilling. Shit, I literally am probably gonna about to start cleaning out my damn closet again for like the third time in history this week. <laughs> Cause I'm just freaking bored, y'all. I'm tired of laying down. It's like I'm just I wake like what like I don't even sleep, but like I just I'm when I mean I wake up, I'm like I get off the bed, I hop off the bed in the morning, just like around eleven or ten. Then I'm just sitting like looking like a damn fool. Then I'm just like messing around cleaning whatever I could find to clean, vacuum whatever. Then I sometimes I eat breakfast, sometimes I don't. It just depends. Like the last two days, I haven't been eating breakfast. Uh. And then I would just be chilling. Then I either go to the store with my dad or with my mom. But today we didn't go to the store. Either one of us. I didn't go with my mom or my dad today because they didn't go to the store today. Uh, I was outside though with the baby and with my mom and her grandma. But then I took the baby for a little stroll in her stroller. But then we came back inside right away. And uh, I just been here. It just chilling like on well actually I I pin like I was watching um YouTube uh everybody who I'm subscribed to I was watching the videos and stuff and then 
<laughs> man, the video that I was like, well, was the one of uh, Bawadis, uh and Jackie. I don't know. They're like, they say they're exes, but to me, it's like, man, y'all still got feelings for each other. Like, you could tell right off the back, and you could tell that it's not like anything that's plotted. You tell, you could tell that their feelings are real, you know? You can tell when somebody's being legit real and somebody's being, like, fake. So, when... <laughs> it was so funny. I want to ruin it for y'all, but I'm going to ruin it anyway. If you haven't seen the video, and if y'all know who that is, go subscribe to his channel. Super Wattis. That's Face Rug's brother. Because a lot of people know Face Rug a little bit more because he got some more subscribers than his brother. His brother is, like, at 400... I mean, 400... At 4 million? I think 4 million subscribers. And Facebook is at a little bit more. So, um, uh, yeah, I was just like, whoa, like that video. I kept, I watched that video like three times already too. It's just so, that's just how funny it was where he like tried to kiss her every hour <laughs> and then like kind of got butt hurt. <laughs> he said he didn't, but it looked like he did. Uh, that would have been totally me though. I, I would have been totally but hurt as well. So, you ain't the only one, bro. I, w I felt your pain right there, man. When she kept rejecting you, bro, I felt your pain. Like, I know what it feels like to when you kiss your ex and, you know, she pulls away and say some, sh like, some crazy shit, even though Jackie didn't mean it, but yeah, hey, shit. Your boy's been in that position before, and that shit is just a feeling you don't ever want to feel like. Because it's like, man, I used to kiss you, and you used to love it, and now you just pull it away. What the hell, man? <laughs> uh, that video right there, though. Shit, I think when I'm done editing all my stuff, I think I'm going to go watch this video again. Because I just, I'm just, that video is just, whoa. <laughs> like, I, I like videos like that. <laughs> it's just cool. Um, and then I was watching, uh, Jonathan and Nikki V, their, the video they had on Jonathan's page as well. Um, I think they're the most cutest, youngest couple out there, honestly. I'm just like, I could picture them having a future together, uh, just because the way they are with each other and, you know, he's a respectful guy that you vote well, well, by what they show on the video because you know we don't see everything but what we do see is just like you know um but of course you know we all have a side where you know ain't no ain't no relationship and ain't nothing perfect in this damn world man that's just what I, people need to understand like i hate I don't know if females feel the same way about us dudes, but I hate when females say, oh, you could find somebody better than me. Like, why would you even say that? Like, come on now, man. Like, stop talking nonsense, you know? Like, ain't nobody out there better than you. Like, if I'm with you, I'm with you because obviously I love you and I care about you and I want to be with you. It's not because I'm trying to play a damn board game. Like, hell no. Um... So them two are a cute couple. So go subscribe to both of them, their channels, to Jonathan and then to and Nikki V. Who else video did I watch today? Mm. I've been watching a lot of people's videos, guys. But the main ones that uh, that I was like so into today was Broadis and Jonathan. It's on jo Jonathan's channel where they were making cookies. I uh, like him and his girl like those two videos right there were dope you know what i'm saying i always give everybody's videos though a thumbs up and i always comment on it because i just feel like even as me doing youtube myself i just feel like you gotta uh, be supportive of one another and what's like yeah there's a point where you have to like being honest but it's like if i'm being honest if i like your video hey i like your video and if i'm giving your video a thumbs up because i know how hard it takes you know to as a matter of fact it's already hard enough going outside with or you know if you're going outside in public with a camera of course right now we can't really be outside outside doing well i really never do lit as videos but like all the youtubers that i watch that do lit as videos like i know sometimes you know sometimes it's hard because you know people are just staring at you like what the hell are you doing walking and talking that damn camera for you know 
And a lot of people that don't do YouTube, they will never understand the struggle to having to compose the video all together, edit and all that. Especially if you do it yourself. It's 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 a damn job, man. It ain't no piece of cake. Don't think that, oh, it's easy. Hell no, it's not easy. It's freaking hard, you know? And then a lot of people actually want, you know, to make their content really, really lit. So, you know, that's putting in money and putting in work. So that's why I think everybody on YouTube deserves a thumbs up, you know. I don't throw no hate and no shade towards anybody because at the end of the day, everybody works their ass off, you know. It's not about fucking, oh yeah, I got this or I got that. And most of everybody that I know, they're humble, you know. They freaking still go out and help the public and all that. Like, I'll I be tripping out when I be seeing all these damn player haters talking crap about all these and a lot of these people that they talk crap about, I'm subscribed to. So I just, like, I had to bite my tongue, though. Because I'm just like, man, like, y'all throwing shades. And y'all over here don't even know the real story behind what's going on. And y'all just over here throwing shade after shade after shade after shade. Like, to these people, like, chill out, man. If you don't got enough evidence, like, don't say shit at all. Like, why are you trying to get clout off of somebody else? Just because your title is going to be with their name on it like there ain't no point of you trying to get clout like that honestly <laughs> but that's how my day's been going though so i hope y'all had a great day though and i'm about to probably watch that video one more time and then i'm gonna clean my closet <laughs> so much love uh thanks for all the love and support don't forget to like comment share subscribe join the team and join the squad and i will see y'all tomorrow with that being said i'm out chill things i gonna turn you on hope you feel the vibe when you hear this song you a boss i'm a boss too little baby when i pull it would you